In today's video, we're going to talk about SkillNuts, a long form AI generator, how it can help you produce amazing quality content for your blog post. So let's dive in and take a look at how that works. Once at your dashboard, you can go to the SEO assistant to go to the AI powered SEO assistant. From here, we can fill in any keyword we want to rank for. So for example, um, how to become a um, graphic designer. And here you can choose the country where you want to rank. So Skillnut will search Google for this specific country and what articles are going to rank and come up with some great suggestions. For now, let's leave it at United States and create a report. So the report has been generated. So let's take a look at what this report includes. So let's just open the report. And from here, you will be able to patch all kinds of details that you can use to optimize your own blog post for SEO purposes. So as you can see the top page statistics, you will also see your NLP terms. So NLP terms are like graphic designer, Adobe Illustrator, logo, certificate, illustrations, and you have about 70 NLP terms. You also can see the competition. So these are the ranks of competition, rank one up to rank 30, as you can see here. If you want to, you can also take a look at the article by pressing the eye icon and you can just scroll through to see what they are covering. So as you can see, you also have the teams and these teams are based on the search terms that users, people are searching for on Google search engines. So you can see how to become a graphic designer without a degree, how to become a graphic designer online. So this, these teams could give you insights on how to customize your own article title, right? And here you have commonly uh, asked questions, basically FAQs. The common questions, as you can see here, are about 40 in total. And the ones with these icons, these blue icons are generated by Skillnot. And you will also see that you have Reddit and Quora uh, FAQ that you can include inside your, own, uh, inside your own article. Here you also have uh, citations that you could use. So let's start by opening the editor. And this is the difficult part, right? Because how do you want to begin? At the right hand side, you have all your NLP terms that you might want to include to score higher on the search engines for multiple keywords. You have your competition where you can take a look at the articles itself. You have your questions that you can also include, but how do you begin and what would be your intro uh, to a blog article like this, right? So to help you with this, Skillnot also has templates. And if you want to use one of the templates, you can see a blog title creator. You have also an intro paragraph, introduction paragraph. So let's do this. And let's say how to become a graphic designer, which is the title of our blog. And let's generate the content. Only takes a couple of seconds and here you are. If you're passionate about graphic design, you can make a career out of it. Graphic designers work with visual content, including logos, website layouts, product packaging, and more. Some graphic designers may focus on digital graphics alone or combine both print and digital work to create highly customized visuals. So here you also have another topic that you can use and you can even generate more. But for me, the first one will suffice. So I will add this by pressing the plus icon. And there you have it directly added to your and uh, towards your editor so how to proceed further with content generation right because it can be really really difficult you can use uh, some of the ai operators so you can uh, generate questions about the content topics about the content uh, outline about the content summarize conclude the content as well but since this is only an introduction paragraph it can be a little bit tricky to use one of these AI operators because it could not be as detailed as we need it to. So let's actually just use write with AI and see what Skillnot comes up with. So I just generated a few lines of content with just the button write with AI. And if this suits your needs, you can do so. 
But you can also take a look at some of the questions that are being asked, right? So what is the best way to become a graphic designer? That is one of the questions that could turn into a headline. So instead of all this, and then let's add this question to the editor and let's see what Skillnut can come up with. So write with AI. Okay, let's generate a little bit more. There we go. And then we can take a look at other uh, questions that are being asked by people. So let's include this one, for example, and let's see what Skillnut comes up with. There we go. Write a little bit more. And as you can see, because Skillnut now has some more context about the topics itself, it's also going to generate its own headlines. As you can see here, we now have another headline generated by Skillnut. So let's turn this into a headline as well and let Skillnut proceed. There we go. You can just write a little bit more. And as you can see, we have another topic here. So what skills do I need to be a graphic designer? You can just generate a new header and let's, and as you can see the Topics are being generated by Skillnot automatically now because it has more context. And if we take a look at the NLP terms, you will see that a lot of checkboxes are automatically already filled by Skillnot's AI content generation. One thing to note is that you always need to check the generated AI content. This is because you cannot just generate AI content and put it onto your website as a blog article. It needs to be a little bit more personal. It needs to be having a little bit of a human touch to it. Now, if you have a few sentences that might be a little bit too technical, you could also say, I'm going to copy this and then go to the templates. And there is also a section to simplify a sentence. So if I want to simplify a sentence, I'm just pasting it inside, generate the content. And here you have the simplified sentence. So if something is getting too technical because of the generated AI output, you can just copy that sentence and use one of the templates like simplify a sentence to really get a completely new output. So this could also work if you are copy and pasting text from different kinds of articles and you want to rewrite the content a little bit. So you can use the simplify a sentence to generate a new output, which has the same meaning, but it is a little bit more simplified. Now, sometimes the AI can get stuck or does not know how to proceed with the content itself. If this happens, you can use one of the AI connectors and the AI connectors will give more context as to what you want to do with the article, which direction do you want to go. So for example, if I say something like, however, and let AI write, as you can see here, it knows it understands the context that which way which direction do you want to go with your content and will be able to pick up on that and generate new content for you so using the ai connectors and the ai operators always allows you to take that next step in your content generation so you can see how powerful Skillnut's long form AI content generator is using the templates, using AI connectors, using AI operators to change the direction of your content along with the SEO optimized report that you have on the right hand side of your article, which you can use to include NLP terms, include frequently asked questions that people ask around the internet. So search engines, Quora, Reddit, and even generated questions by Skillnot itself to really get the most out of an article and rank much better inside of search engines yourself. So be sure to grab yourself a copy of Skillnot today. The link will be on top and in the video description and give it a try yourself.